we're gonna be doing the base bump effect as you have seen in the beginning of this tutorial so I've got my video and my audio so the audio you need is an audio that has a lot of bass in it so you won't stress yourself out when editing so I got my stock footage and my audio from Big Soup Bay I'll leave link in the description box below for you guys to go download this lovely stock footage i got from pixel bay so let's start this tutorial yeah we're back so um i'll just drag my video down here and drag my audio down to the audio layer so i'll stretch this out and link our audio to our video because it's very important if you don't link it now when you want to link it again it should just spoil your editing so you just click on link and it's linked already so we just got our audio right here control b and delete this part we don't need that part at all so we'll stretch this out so that as you can see our base is at the top here so it has already splitted our base for us the audio already has a splitted base line so this editing won't be hard for you guys but if you have an audio that the base line is a little bit small you can just use the Movavi beat detection and if you click on your audio scene detection I'm <laughs> um, sorry when you go to audio beat detection and you see beat detect audio beat so you just click on detect audio beat it just detect your beat for you um depend depending on your frame that you want your audio to be so guys let's start the bass bump effect so first what you do is click on your video and check out the first part where your bass starts and control b you cut and give a space at the middle you cut again so this space here is where you'll be adding your base effect so you do that to all these base at the top here so let me just do two then i'll speed ramp the video um control b control b and i left some space here for the audio to continue before it goes to another base line then control b control b so i'll do this very fast so that i don't waste your time on this tutorial so let's do this So guys now we are done with cutting so as you can see i left some space in between i told you guys when you leave a space in between that's where you'll be to continue then go back to another baseline so i'll just stretch this out again you need to stretch out your clip so that you can see what you're, you're, you're doing like so you can see what you're doing and you click on the place you want to add your base bump effect go crop and no sorry yeah banner zoom click on panel zoom you can see zoom in zoom in is the best if you zoom out to give you a long effect what you don't want that's what it will give you but if you want to try that out you're free to try it out so we'll just drag our zoom in here then adjust the zoom in so i'll just drag this here and drag this down drag this to the top and that's just it so that's what you do for the rest of your video just drag zoom in then adjust it to your frame because if you leave it as small as that your base bump effect will be ah uh, to be in a bad shape it won't look good at all so you have to adjust it like this so that it suit the frame and give it some space so you can be able to feel the base and i'll just do this throughout the remaining clip so i'll just speed up the clip so i won't waste much time So guys, now we are done adding our um, 
pan and zoom effect so let's check out the preview on how our video looks like so i'll just make this full screen as you can see full screen move have you upgraded their software and made it more interesting so just click on full screen and play this video and see how it went So guys that's how our video will look like when you add a bass bump effect so that's all for this tutorial it's very simple it's very easy if you want to add your black bars you can add it from movavi here or you can just go and search for black bars on google play store but i'll leave one in the description box below for you to go and download black bars you can just add your black bars do some color correction and that's all so guys if you like this video please don't forget to smash that subscribe button and share this video with your friends leave a like for me i would really appreciate it. and you can also leave your comments in the comment box below if you want me to do any effect for you guys thanks for watching see you in my next tutorial peace